Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Randall Bowman and Brian Sickle here at Greenville High School for tonight's titanic struggle between the Greenville Green Wave and the Fairborn Firebirds. Um, we don't know if we've got the A team here tonight or the B team here. What team we've got, Brian? I think it's the B team. The B team. Okay, it's the B team. Uh, I think uh, Alex and, and Ty are both called to ESPN for an interview. Is what I think is what I think they are. I think they're heading over to Columbus for the uh, or to Indy for the big game tomorrow. Could very well be. Could very well be. But again, tonight we've got um, the one and one Greenville Green Wave playing the zero and two Fairborn Firebirds. Skyhawks. 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 Stand corrected. First mistake of the night. So anyway, what we um, we're planning on a great game here tonight. It looks like uh, the scoring's fairly even for both teams, and we're going to just have to see what happens. Yeah, I think Fairborn uh, graduated a lot of guys from last year's team. Uh, they got a lot of juniors playing that probably played a lot of JV last year, so uh, I'm sure they're struggling a little bit, uh, but we'll see what happens tonight. Should be a good game, hopefully. Right. Got a Greenville team that's improving in that they've got one win this year, more than they had last year. We looked up the records from last year, and we got thumped pretty bad by Troy, which on Thursday or Tuesday night, Tuesday night. we got beat by 10. So, again, a, an improving Greenville Green Wave team. Oh, yeah, much, much improved. Uh, got a lot of quickness out there. Having Marcus, hopefully for the whole season. Fletch is back. He, he did get a little injury uh, Tuesday night. I think he's expected to play some tonight, not, maybe not the whole game. Uh, Nolan's quick out there. Of course, Tyler. Mikey's really quick out there. I think a big key is going to try to keep Foster Cole on the court tonight. Been getting in foul trouble the last couple games, and we need him out on the floor a lot more. Correct, correct. Well, we'll be back in just a minute with the start of tonight's game. Ladies and gentlemen, we're back here tonight for the start of tonight's game between uh, Greenville Green Wave and uh, Fairborn Skyhawks. Starting lineups for tonight's game will be for the visiting Skyhawks from Fairborn will be number uh, three, which is Dwight Lewis. He's averaging 12 points per game. Uh, number 11 will be Nate Fosnott. He's, he's a, a five foot nine inch junior. Number 23 is a six foot three inch forward, Garrison Seacrest. Number 33 is a six foot one inch uh, junior, uh, Julius Pullen. And six foot uh, freshman guard number forty four is Kalen Bush. So we got Dwight Lewis, Nate Fosnott, Garrison Seacrest, Julius P Poland, and Caleb Bush. For the Greenville Green Wave, we got our typical starting lineup. Number one is Marcus Wood, a five foot nine inch guard. Marcus is averaging 5.5 assists per game, and he's third in the MVL on assists. Another captain is Alec Fletcher, a six foot one inch senior. Number four, Alec Fletcher. N uh, number five is Tyler Bikey, a senior guard, six foot tall. At center is number 20, Foster Cole, and a captain, six foot two inch. And a sophomore guard, number five foot eight inch, 34 is Nolan Curtis. So for the Greenville Green Wave, we got Marcus Wood, a captain, Alec Fletcher, a captain, Tyler Bikey, a captain, Foster Cole, a captain, and sophomore Nolan Curtis. Brian, here we go. It's yep. time to play some MVL basketball. It's time. I'm glad to see Alec back in the lineup. He uh, had injured himself on Tuesday night with his shoulder. He's had that problem for a couple years now. And Talking to Coach Joseph before the game a little bit, he said uh, Alex's going to give it a go. He'll probably be uh, in and out of the lineup quite a bit tonight. I don't think he's going to be able to go full tilt the whole game, but hopefully nothing happens tonight with him and uh, we can get a good game out of him. Well, as we talked in the pregame, you and I, we, it just he is just a, a good kid, number one, and number two, he, he's just, he's a, he's a, he guts it out all the time. Oh, uh, he hustles all the time. He's always on the floor for loose balls. Fighting in there for rebounds. Just just a good, solid, hard-nosed kid. Yep. So in the jump circle, we got Foster Cole for Greenville. And number three, or I'm sorry, yeah, number three, Dwight Lewis for um, Fairborn. 
We have a bit of a mystery here tonight in that Bailey Snap um, is a junior averaging 12 points per game, and he's nowhere to be seen, so we cannot find Bailey Snap. There is a young man that's got his arm wrapped up down there on their bench, but uh, we don't know for sure if that's Mr. Snap or not. So here we go. Uh, Marcus is in the corner there with um, getting ready to pass to Alec down to Alec Fletcher. Spin move out to Marcus up for three short. Got his own rebound. Good job into the hole and two. Good job, Marcus Wood. You know, I was looking at the stats. Marcus is leading us in rebounds, too. Oh. He's averaging a little over six and a half. Got to keep him on the floor, yeah, too, do. tonight. Exactly. Yep, yep. Can't, can't get the open. Oh. Good move inside. Good job. Alec Fletcher with a rebound. Marcus bringing the ball up the court. This, uh, you know, we got four seniors starting for Greenville this year, but as we talked in the JV game, the JV's got some kids down there that can come up here next year and fill in. We got a couple kids off the bench that can play pretty good ball. So um, the cupboard's not as bare as it used to be a no, couple years ago I don't think for Greenville. So. Right. No. Right. So, yeah, this is a good senior class. I mean, we had a good football season this year. Uh, right there's our quarterback for the football team. Oh. Alec Fletcher played a wide receiver. Uh, Marcus played every position there was on the yeah. football team. So it's a good, talented senior class that we have at Greenville this year. Got some good quickness out on the floor, too, and Bikey and yep. Nolan and Marcus and yep. Fletch. Foster can hit that. Airborne brings the ball up the court. With a little travel there. But Look like it. Rebound. Foster Cole, good job, Foster. Greenville coming down here now to set something up. Ooh, might have had a lane to drive in there. Uh, I think Nolan would prefer to shoot that three-pointer. Yeah, there's no doubt about that. Uh, he he, he's shooting a little over 50% from three-point line this year yep. so far. Got to get back, guys. Oh, wow. Is this the NBA? That looked like uh, an NBA move that, to me. That's that Euro step they <laughs> let him do anymore, and I don't, I don't uh, see it either. I don't like it. I don't like it. It's not the way we played 100 years ago, no, right? No, that's, that's right. That's right. Uh, Greenville man-to-man -man right now, but you know what? So they've, been, they've been playing some zone. Oh, it's a three from the big boy. Greenville's been playing some zone this year. Oh, it looks like Fairborn's yep. coming out in a little one-two-two. Two. Press. Press. Good. Get it into the middle and go. Exactly what you got to do. Take it Get to in the there. Good job. Good job, Nolan. Get that ball in the middle and go right to the basket. That's what you got to do. Oh, that's a walk. No. Got somebody hurt. What? I don't know. Everybody seems confused. Especially the guys in the stripes. I don't know what. I think they're. I Maybe official was hurt. I don't know what all that was about, but Fairborn has the ball. Yeah. That's all we know. Oh, good, good move. Yeah, Got to watch this big kid. He could have an over the back. Wow. On pulling. Yep. Yeah, Fairborn in the one, two, two. Fletch taking it out. Goes right to the middle. Good job. Go right. That's now right. we got a three on two. We Take sure it do. right to the hole, Bikey. Oh. oh, wow, nice block. That was a nice block. Yeah. He come from nowhere. He did. With 23, Mr. Seacrest, six foot three inch. He's jumped like he was six eight. Fairborn man to man. Mm -hmm. Oh, go to the basket. Good. That's it, Alex. Get in there. Marcus. Oh. Okay. Lewis with handling the ball right now. He's averaging 12 points a game. I'm telling Good you. Move. Good move. <laughs> look up. Got to look up. There you go. Take that, Nolan. Come on, baby. Hit it. Yep. Yep. A little adrenaline's flowing. Oh, 33. That's two. That's two on number 33. 
End of the game for Fairborn number five, Cole Spencer coming in for Mr. Pullen. Yep, and uh, DJ Zimmer's in for Greenville. DJ is off to a great start. He, he's averaging 3.5 blocks per game, and he's that second in the MVL. His field goal percentage is 80%. So hey. that's... He's, he's averaging 12 a game. He's come off the bench and has done a real nice job. Yes, he has. Looked like Fairborn, just like that. That's what he does. He yep. gets a lot of that Gets a lot of that uh, offensive rebound, gets some garbage stuff. He does. Looked and like he, uh, Fairborn was in a zone on that possession. And again, going back to football, he was Mr. Everything in football. He, he, played, a, he, he played great in football for a sophomore. Right. Gotta help, oh. gotta help, gotta help. Get in there, Marcus. Uh, looks like we're, we're out running a little bit more tonight than what, yeah. what I, we have. I don't know if that's such a good idea against Fairborn there. Good move again. Well, they just. There's DJ getting another rebound. Yeah. This is a run and gun and game right so far. Yes, Get it is. that, Nolan. Come on, baby. God. One pass and shoot yep. tonight. Oh. Oh. That's when you got to be in those passing lanes. Pick, yep. that, pick that thing that. up. With the stage crew shouting Trying defense. To, oh, good backdoor cut. Yep. Grab it, DJ. Good. Go right to the basket, Tyler. Yeah, good job, Tyler. Oh, they come right back down. Number 44, the freshman. Seven to six lead by Fairborn. Yep. Timeout, Fairborn, I believe. It's like a 30 second timeout. We'll stay right here. Um, in the freshman game, um, or I'm sorry, in the JV game, the Greenville Green Wave won 42-33. Alex Bumgardner had eight. Hayden Bush had 13. Cameron Fletcher had six. And Million Bryant had 15 for a total of 42. They looked really good, I thought. And again, as we said earlier, the cupboard's not bare anymore. A um, couple players down there looking sure. pretty good. Well, as we yeah. talked earlier, too, you only need like four, maybe four per class. If you, have, if you have four per class and you can have a dozen on a varsity team or something like that, you're always replenishing right, and keep right. coming right and that's back. That's what they need, exactly. Exactly, yep. Fairborn coming out in a 1-3-1. One, one. Looks like a 1-3-1. One, one sure does. Half court. Not too much trapping, just trying to play at 1-3-1 one, one without trapping right now. They could bring them out of that. Nolan could hit a couple threes out yeah, there. Yeah, that's what, that's what we need. Our... Uh, we haven't shot a whole lot. I think we've only taken 18 threes this year. There's been some years where we've taken 18 threes in, in one game. Yeah, exactly. Nolan with another three and nowhere close. Now, the mm. thing is here, Nolan can't give up a shooting. He's too good of a shooter to stop. He's right. got to keep shooting. He does. That's you got to. Sometimes a good shooter and, has to shoot themselves out of it. And, well, and the thing he's got to do maybe is try taking the ball to the basket just a little bit. Huh? Getting a little closer. Here it comes, looks like the way's out in a 1-3-1. Get in there, Marcus. good job, Marcus. That's gonna be a foul on. 44? 44, the freshman. That's their third. See if Mark can finish the three-point play here. Bingo. Yes. Good job. Good job. Wave up 9-7 with 2.35 to go in the first quarter. Oh. oh, wow. How could that not be a foul? Good closeout. Wow. 44. Freshman what? has five of their ten points. Yeah, I guess that's why he starts. Step up, Foster. You can hit that. Yeah. 
jump, jump ball. Jump ball. Fairborn, Fairborn possession. Ball. But there was DJ in there getting another rebound, yep. trying to get a rebound. Nolan was in there mixing it up. That's, that's what we need. Number two, Tyron Schultz, a five foot 10 inch senior in the game now for Fairborn. DJ oh. with a block. Yeah, but I. Gets a freshman. <laughs> uh, that, uh, that was a. Well, we'll just let's let it go at that. <laughs> now it looks like the looks like Fairborn's uh, in a man. In a man, it must be going, might be going man on a miss. Hit that, Marcus. Cash. Good rebound, right up. Foster. Up. Needed to have that. Yep, those are the ones you got to have. Oh, close. Oh. Nah. Number five. Cole Spencer with a basket. His first two of the night. Oh, that's a foul. Number two. That's their fourth team foul. And Nolan will be going to line shooting two. Here's where you can help. Help yourself out too a little bit yes. by hitting, hitting a foul shot. Yeah, yeah, getting in a little bit of a rhythm. Yep. Fairborn brought a nice little crowd up here tonight. Yes, they did. You know, they did. First one's up and good. Good, good job, Nolan. Minute left to go, 12 to 10, Fairborn. 12, 11. Good. Back it up, like, one, yeah. three, one, one, two, two, trapping. Yep. Get down, recover. See that? They got, got some good quick. Oh, Ooh, good move. Nice move. Good move. Big C here with the wave just goes for one. Now they're back in that zone. I think they're going zone on a make and man on ah, a miss. I think you're right. No, back out. 24 now we seconds. go for one. Now go for just one. We get the ball at the quarter. Foster says no. Oh, man. Mm. I think we're 0 for 6 so far from three. Oh, good steal. Go, Marcus. You got plenty of time. Good. Don't foul. Good job. All right. All right. At the end of one, it's the Fairborn Skyhawks 14, Greenville 13. We'll be back in a minute. Okay, we're back for the start of the second quarter. Teams are still in the huddle here, getting ready to, to come out for the second quarter. Uh, Wave, pretty good first quarter, I thought. Uh, if we could hit some couple threes. Yeah, right now we're not hitting that three. I still think the best thing for us to do is just keep trying to go right to the basket. Uh, I agree. Yep, I agree with that. Um, yep. I think uh, Fletcher's coming in for Bikey, giving Bikey a little bit of rest. Jay Spunger's in for... Well, Foster Cole's Foster out. Foster Cole for a little bit of rest. Nice to see Foster didn't have any fouls. Yes. Uh, last first two games, he's been in some foul trouble, so it's nice to see yep. him not uh, have any fouls. It's going to be wave ball. Well, quite honestly, the Greenville Green Wave had no fouls in the no first fouls. quarter. And one, two, three, four, four on Fairborn. So pretty clean game, I guess. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Fairborn back in that 1-3-1. One, one. Yeah. DJ needs to get right down that block when that ball's opposite of him. Get down the block right now, DJ. Come on, Chase. No. Uh-oh. There we go. Have. And I bragged, I bragged too soon. DJ on DJ the back. DJ over the back. DJ is first. Team is first. 
You know, I said we'd only taken 18 threes for the whole season. I think we've taken <laughs> seven, so, eight. I'd say. No one's had three. Foster's had a couple. Marcus. So, oh. It was close. I tell you, Marcus Wood, he's got some quickness and some hops to him. You he just, does. He does. This number three, this little kid's not a bad ball player he's himself. A, he is a good ball player. Yep. Six foot two inch junior. Averaging 12 points a game. There hit it, Come Nolan. On, Nolan. Man, just not hitting that nope. right now tonight. All right. Okay, well, he turned it over. That's fine. Yeah. With Foster out of the game, we got Nolan now out front with Marcus. Oh, Marcus, that wasn't a smart move. Good job. But look Fletch. at Alec Fletcher. Yep. There he is again, hustling down the floor. Yep. I'm telling you, I, I just I am impressed with that kid. I really am. He just gives it 110% all the time. Yep. Bikey into the game for Nolan. Give him a little bit of rest. Yeah, he just. Greenville he, back to man to man. Good move by number five, Spencer. Wave down by three. Six. Oh, goodness. We've got to watch those passes, guys. Got to step up. See, DJ needs yeah. to be on that. Come on, Tyler. I still think when the ball's on the one side, we need to have that guy on the corner on the block. Yep. Dry, that would drop that, that defensive wingman down a little bit, and free up that other guard. Yep, I agree. I agree. He's got Foster Cole back in the game. Jay Spunger. Oh, middle's wide open. There's, oh. a, there's a foul on Foster. That's his first. Team, Team second. second. Foster Cole fouled Cole Spencer. <laughs> Lefty puts it in. So last year, we it dug into some records from last year, and at Fairborn last year, the Wave got beat 83 to 30. I don't think it's going to be that way this year. No, I don't think it will be either. Like I said, they lost a lot. I think they had seven, six or seven seniors on that team last year. Right. So uh, They're still in that 1-3-1. One, one. Yeah. Move the ball. Move it. we got to move it just a little quicker. Yep. Somebody needs to be at the high post. Just flash, Foster. Yeah, somebody's got to move. Travel on Fletch. Mm. Another wave down 18 13. They got it. There's Marcus with another deflection. Those long rebounds will get you every time. Yeah. They seem to never go in our direction. <laughs> See, they got a man at the high post that they can get the ball to. That's what we need to get a man at the high post. Yep. Flashing in there just like that. Oh. But not throw it away. No, like exactly. That. Again, I, I, I don't understand where, why you have your big man down in the corner. For first of all, I don't think DJ could hit a three. Well, no, DJ needs to be in the middle, and Foster right. needs to be on the wing. Or one of them needs to. We need somebody in the middle, right, to give that ball up to. Now we got DJ out front. Timeout. Now, if Fairborn was wise right here. 
They can come back out in the man to man because you know we're going to be talking about what yeah. to do against the zone. Exactly. Yeah. That's they exactly. should come back out in a different zone, maybe a two three or back to man to man and and get us messed up for a couple times. <laughs> See if our kids can remember what to do then against the 1-3-1 one, one no, when we get in there. That's right. I mean, I will say this. We're playing more zone this year than we have in the past few well, years. Yeah, yeah. But, well, I mean, you just have to, I think. when. Well, when you don't have a lot of depth on right. the bench, you, you've got to save those guys from getting in foul trouble, and, you know, a zone can do that. Sure, sure. Yep. Well, that and, and sometimes and we don't have the speed to keep up with them. Well, we, I think we got some speed to keep up. We just don't have anybody inside that can be a dominating force, you know. If they're penetrating to, to uh, block shots or, you know, deflect balls or whatever. And, um, right. So, yeah, we, we need to play a little bit more zone. Well, they're staying in that 1-3-1. One, one. Sure. See, I, I think I would have uh, – no, flash. Somebody needs to flash. Yeah, see, DJ no good out there. Uh-uh. He, he's not going to help us out there, I don't think. Hit that bikey. Penetrate it in. Yeah, that's what you got to do. Get that's, in there, Foster. That's there you go. That's what you, you got to do. That's Foster's that's, first two of the night. That's our first basket of the quarter. Yeah. Three and a half minutes in. Uh, waves back, uh, back to man to man. Oh, man, that kid just flew by. Come on, rebound. Box out, guys. Here we go. We're easy, 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 easy. I'll tell you, threes are not our friends Cannot tonight. hit the three. Oh, oh nice job. Block. Now, one on. That's it. All right, all right, all right. 18-13, just under four minutes to go in the half. Really don't have anybody in foul trouble for Greenville. we got no, two guys with two. and Really haven't yeah. called a lot of fouls. Well, and that, again, playing that zone, you're not going to probably right. get a lot of fouls. Right. We need somebody, another guard out here. Yeah, Marcus has got to penetrate that thing. Yes. That's it, Fletch. Yes. Come on, Tyler. You got to be ready to shoot. Tyler's got to look to shoot that thing. Yep. Dribbling against the zone just doesn't work. Good block by Good DJ job. again. Yeah, sure was. Good job. Oh, look down the floor. Look down. She didn't use the block there that he was a oh. screen. Oh, oh my. Wow. Well. <laughs> I don't know if that's the shot Coach Joseph would want, but, oh. And number three just come right down and did a Euro step and laid it in, and Bikey got a foul. <laughs> Nolan's in for Marcus. So now we'll probably have uh, Nolan being the guard right now. Yep. Ball handler. Uh, get on the floor, guys. Oh, jump ball, it's their ball. Greenville will go man to man on this out of bounds play underneath. Good job, good job. Now Fairborn will go man to man on a miss. Yeah. Come on, Nolan, do something. Gotta penetrate. Five second. Gotta penetrate. Our guys, our guys got to recognize that miss, they're going to go man to man, and we got to get back into our man to man offense. Right. Whoa. We'll let him take that shot. Yeah. 
He might have traveled. Oh, a oh. oh, little late. Nolan, a little late. Marcus is getting ready to come back yeah. in the game. Good little move. Oh, geez. Holy moly. Whoa! Well, of all people, you didn't expect to probably make a three. Our first three tonight would have been Him. Zimmer off his foot. Marcus back in the game for, for Fletch. Fletch. A minute 51 to go in the oh, second no. quarter. Taking Foster out. Taking Foster out. Wave down two. Uh, back in the 1-3-1, one, one, a dead ball. That's it, Bikey. That's the way to come into the middle. Ah, come on, Nolan. Good hustle. It's all right, good hustle. You make the mistake and hustled after it. This, this again. We're we're a team that we just can't afford turnovers like that. They just we. Other teams probably can because they're deeper. They're maybe a little bit better, et cetera. But this this team can't afford turnovers. No, we can't. Take care of the ball. That's it. Hit that. Oh, Ooh, over the wow. back. Should have been over the back. No kidding, oh, hit that. Gosh. Attaboy, DJ. All right, DJ. I love that kid. Yeah, I he, really he, do. He plays hard. <laughs> he does play hard. Oh. Oh, and a block. <laughs> Back tied, 22-22. Minute to go. Come on, Wave. Let's finish this out now. Oh, double team. Get it, get go it, get, get, it, get it. it. Go get it. Good pass. Oh. Oh. Woo. Fletch was trying to shoot it before he had it. Nolan. Or Nolan, yes. Excuse me. Thirty-three is back in the game. Number three, Lewis, back in. He's sort of, uh, uh, he's got six points. Yeah. The Spencer kid come off the bench. He's their leading scorer right now with eight. Yeah. Oh. Get him, DJ. That's it. Good D. Get, oh. Tied up 22-22. About 20 seconds to go in the Fairborn's game. Fairborn's probably going to try to go for one. Yep. I don't think they'd try to go for one now. Oh, we got a mismatch there. Good. Go. Go. 10 seconds. We need to hit one here. Ah. Uh, uh, got picked his pocket. Picked his pocket. Don't foul. Don't foul. No. Tied at All half. All right. Tied up at halftime, 22-22. We'll be back with the second half in just a couple minutes. Ladies and gentlemen, Randall Bowman and Brian Stickle back for the second half of tonight's Titanic struggle. 22-22 at halftime. Um, I don't know. I, I think pretty good game. Pretty good game. Wade's got to start hitting those threes. I think we're probably one for nine maybe out of the three. Yep. Um, both teams playing some zone. Foul trouble. Nobody's in foul trouble. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, yeah. you know, considering Fairborn lost lost a lot of kids from last year's team, this is only their second or third game. Wave, you know. Third game. Marcus didn't play a whole heck last year. <laughs> Alec didn't play any. So, you know, some inexperience going on in both teams. It's right. I think it's going to come down to who can who can solve each other's zone right here is what it's going to come down to. Well, and I think to your point, a very valid point in that if we can hit some threes, that'll certainly help. Uh, yeah, if we can hit some threes and get them out of that, that zone, I think uh, will help us out a lot. Right. So it looks like I think Fairborn, it's Fairborn's, ball. Fairborn's ball. Both teams have their original starters in. Uh... 
Looks like the wave's so, going to start off in man here. Yep. So here we go. Nate Fosnott goes oh, to the middle. Oh. Looked like he almost traveled there. Uh, uh, there we go. Uh, we didn't need that from Foster. We sure didn't. We That's sure didn't. Two. Twenty-three Seacrest. That's Seacrest's first basket of the night. Yeah. He's averaging nine a game. Six-three senior. Completes the three-point play. Yep, so, Fairborn right back out in that one, three, one. Again, until we can hit something outside, I don't know why we wouldn't, why they wouldn't. Come on. That's what, uh, stop. Okay, every time he goes down, I yeah, hold my I, breath. Uh, me too. <laughs> <clears throat> A little mismatch inside. Good you know, job, Marcus. Marcus with another rebound. Get it. Oh. Oh, they're back to man. No, they're. Yep. Oh, Nolan, shoot it. Don't baby it. Yep. Shoot it up there. <clears throat> nice pass. Ah. There's oh. number three. Here comes DJ in the game. Yep. Well, it's like I said earlier, we need to keep Foster on the floor. So on, on a shot like that, a breakaway, I mean, yeah, he didn't make it, but we did pick up a critical third foul on our big man. Exactly, so. yeah. That's just a lack of thinking, not running back down the floor on defense. Yep. So DJ's in for Foster. So the Skyhawks have opened up a five-point lead. Start the second half here. <clears throat> Wave's got to figure out a way to take that shot. We got a goodness. Got it. There, DJ at the high post. That's what we need now. You got that's what you need. Right there. We there. Go. Good job. Good job. Needed that guy at the high post and that backside guy down on the block. Right. That middle now is wide open for them. <clears throat> Uh -oh. the, big, the big man taking a three and hits it. Julia, that's two threes for him. Sure is. He's got eight points on the night. Hit that bikey. Good follow. Back out, back out, back out. Oh, wow. All right. We'll take it. Yeah, slow getting down the floor again. Got it, guys. Fairborn takes a timeout. All right, we've got six minutes and two seconds to go in the third quarter. Wave down six. This is a full timeout. So we'll be back in a All right, we're back. Again, six minutes and two seconds to go in the third quarter. Wave down six. So we got to find a way here to score some points. We need a basket here. Big we need time. A big, big basket here. Yep. We got to start getting back on defense just a little quicker. Right. You know, he's commenting they they're without one of their starting players, Bailey Snap, who's averaging 12, but this Cole Spencer has come off the bench and has uh, 11 points, and right. he's averaging uh, 2.5. Right. Tyler with a short just shot. Gotta take sh got just take the shot. Yeah. He got back pretty good that time. We've still on a man. Here we go. Get it down the floor. That's it, Marcus. Move it. Take it. Right to the basket. Oh. Off his foot. You know, we, we, we try to teach down to eighth grade and seventh grade um, where I'm kind of helping out a little bit. 
go to the basket strong. If they're going to foul you, that's fine. Let them go ahead and foul you. I know, I know he's left-handed. Marcus found that shot. He's left-handed, but you got to go with your right hand uh, yeah, into he, the basket. That's all gone, there is to it. Yeah, he should have gone with his right hand to the basket. Yep. There's a long, bad pass that had disaster written all over it. Good steal by Nolan. Yep. Now we've got a four-on-one. Oh, and my we goodness. Didn't Good hut. Goodness gracious. There's four points right there back-to-back -back we should have had. Nice interception. There. Now we got a three on two. Good. That's what we needed. There we go. And that's that's three on him. Yeah. That was a questionable foul. I didn't know. Yeah. He, I didn't know. We'll take it, though. That much, but we will take it. Marcus's first points of the second half. He's got nine for the night. Oh. We got Jace Bunger coming in for Fletch. And Mason Wikes is coming in for Nolan. I'm sure this is just to give uh, Nolan a few minutes rest. And Fletch. Alec a couple yep. minutes. Like we said with that shoulder, I think he's uh, struggling a little bit. Grab it, Good. Mason. Grab it, Mason. Jump bar, all ball, our ball. He's a big boy, that Mason. He's a big boy, <laughs> real big boy. <sighs> Easy, Mason. Don't yeah, foul. It looks like there. he's looks getting like ready. He's trying to. Oh, all right. Back to man to man. Run your man to man offense now. Roll with it. Oh, we got a mass match inside. Get it to him. Get yeah. it to him. Yeah. There we go. Got to get it to him when you've got a yeah. mismatch like that. It's his second. So, again, we, we got a play that's called punch. And basically, if you see a mismatch, then the, guy, the guys are supposed to call punch and play it, play it get, that way. Get it so, again, that's him. what yeah. they had there. Big yeah. man. Yeah. Oh. That's it, roll. Oh. Oh, we got a mismatch. Again. Take it up, Mason. Travel. Yeah, well, I mean, he did. I mean, and the thing of it is, again, as I talked earlier, we're as coaching those kids down, down there, go stay strong yeah, with the ball. You got to keep the ball up high. Right. He takes it down low, and they tie you up. Right. I mean, exactly. It, it just, you, it's yeah, just fundamental had, basketball. He had a mismatch. He needed to just take that ball straight up. Right. Straight up. Oh, trap that. <laughs> Didn't need that. See, Chris. He has six points this quarter. 35 28. Fireborn slowly. Uh, oh, that was huh. luck. Get, Get in, in there. there. Get in there. Number five, Spencer. That's just his first foul. Team's third. Fletcher back in for Mason. A couple pretty good minutes out of Mason here. It didn't yeah, hurt us, yeah, so that, that's no. good. No, Marcus needed to clip mm. two straight three-point plays. He's yep. that's good. Uh, that's a throwaway. Give us a chance to get yep. back. Cut it to three or two. We need somebody to get hot with a three-point play here. A three-point shot. Up oh, there, man to man. Fairborn's going to man to man. Go, DJ. Handle the ball, guys. Get it to him. Yes, yes sir. Good job. That's a great pass from Marcus. Sure was. See in the court. Uh, 
number three. Got to play some D, guys. Uh, back to the back to the zone. Yep. Help out. Coach Joseph calls a timeout. He saw we were struggling a little bit there. Full timeout. So at Abby Cottrell, Aubrey Evers, Cheyenne Harmon, Kaylee McGreevy, Emily Snyder, and Brianna Toomey. And they are coached by Carol Paul. Bring in the spirit for the green wave. They got the stage crew up there about full tonight. It's a yeah, good looking looks group up good. there. Yeah. yeah, looks pretty good. Looks like they're in their white out tonight. Yeah, sure, sure enough. Well, it's going to come down to some strategy here, both coaches. Um, right now, the wave is led by Marcus Wood with 11. And for Fairborn, it looks like uh, Cole Spencer has uh, eight. Yep. Difference right now is one, two, three, four. Fairborn's hit four threes. The wave's only had one. Yep. That's, that's a little big difference right there. Exactly, in the that is the big difference. Wave down five, two and a half minutes to go in the third quarter. Get this possession here, get a two uh, or maybe a three. Back in the zone. Yeah. Well, it looks like they're trapping out of it. That's it, Good. DJ. Back door. Good fake. Get in there, Chase. Good, Good job. That's a good ball fake and a good pass sure by was. DJ. Good wave, job. Wave back in man to man. They got a mismatch themselves. They got uh, Spencer, 6 3 on Chase Bunger, Garden. 6 3 kid. Hit it, Bikey. Hit Come that, on, Tyler. Tyler. Yes. Bingo! There we go. Well, we need it from Tyler. Exactly. He did, he had Two minutes to go, third quarter, tie ball game, 37 all. Come on, defense now, Wave. Def oh, wow. Oh, He's filling that lane, and he'd have had that one. Get off his foot. Trap him. Take a charge. Miss it. Oh, that's Wave ball. Good. Okay, number two, Tyree Schultz back in the goal game. In for Nate Fosnott. Little, little, little full press, court here. press here now. That a boy, Marcus. Yeah, and one. Oh, yes. Good job. <laughs> TJ, DJ showing the muscles. <laughs> Marcus with a nice pass, yes. too. Very nice pass. Refs are talking about something here. I don't know what they're talking about, but. That's Fairborn's fourth foul. Greenville has two fouls. Wave up two. Minute and a half to go. Come on, DJ. Put this one in, buddy. The yeah. Old, got the old-fashioned three-point right. play. We'll take it. We'll take it. Oh, somebody's not playing defense. Come on, guys. Uh, doggone it. Somebody fell asleep there. Yep. I don't know whose man that was, but somebody fell asleep. Relax, Jace. Offensive foul. No. Foul number five, Spencer. That's his second. Nolan Curtis coming back in for Jace. Again, he gave us a good he, few he, minutes he here. He played, played a decent four, exactly. four minutes or so in that round. Scored Real a bucket. Nice. Scored a bucket. Yep. Hit it, Bikey. Short. Nolan trying Good to job. get in there. Good work, Nolan. It's all right. Now let's match up. Help. Oh. Ooh, oh. Wow. Oh. wow. Wow, 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 wow. All right. 52 seconds left to go in the quarter, the wave up one. Oh, oh no, 
Nolan, 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 Nolan. Yes, put it right out in front. No of him. kidding. Should have had it. Yep, sure should have. Screen, get around it. Oh, almost a drag of the pivot foot there. No back door, five, five. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh, help, backside. Nice play. That's from the freshman, I think. Yep. No, no. Schultz hit that, number two. Easy, Tyler. That's it. Let's go for one. Go for one. Go for one if we can. Oh, Marcus. Oh, man. Give us some time. Oh. Go to the basket. Yes! Good job, Marcus. Cole Spencer's just picked up three quick fouls here. Well, he has. Marcus, now hit this free throw. Come on, let's get the old-fashioned three. Somebody get back here. Good and job. Get that Fletch. Shoot it. Get in there. Oh, oh dog. All dog. right. Good job. Good steal. All right. Into three. Wave up. 43 42. We'll be back in a minute. Okay, we're back, folks. Um, boy, what a quarter that was. The Wave scored 22 points in the first half, 21 points in the third quarter. The um, Fairborn Skyhawks scored 22 points in the first half. 19 points in the third quarter. So whatever they gave them at halftime must have worked. Yeah, uh, scoring got picked up there a little bit. Yes, it did. Um, both teams are taking it to the hole a little bit, getting some nice easy baskets and getting yep. some tough baskets inside too. Sure. This will be sure. a very interesting quarter here. Wave, yep. uh, Wave has two timeouts left. Oh. That's a nice play right there. Yeah. Nolan's first. This Cole Spencer's really picked it up. I think yes. I mentioned earlier he's only averaging two and a half points a game, and he has two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, twelve tonight. Oh, wow. Wave, wave almost tipped that in. No kidding. Up, DJ. Oh, good block. Wow, no kidding. No, no one. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> we'll take that, guys. Got, got the shooter's roll he right sure there. He sure did. The good for him. Roll. Ah. Wow, that was a ticky tack. That's DJ's second. Oh, he missed again. He hits four for four, and he's missed his last two. Missed again. DJ with another DJ. rebound. Yep. Back out. That's it. Move it. Oh, that's Ooh. a foul. It's a reach. Into a bad shoulder. Don't hurt our boy. 23. Seacrest is second. Team seventh will be shooting one and one. Come on, Alec. The 33, Julius Poland back in. He has three fouls, but he's also hit two, two threes. threes. Yeah. Exactly. <clears throat> Come on, Alec. Need you, buddy. Oh, 
Wow. The bank's open. You know what? He banked it. He banked one in uh, Tuesday night, I believe, too. Oh, really? Yeah, I believe so. You can just sort of tell that left shoulder just yep. can't lift it up very high. There we Good go. Good job, Alec. Good job, Alec. Wave up five. Oh, uh, wow. That Spencer kid's killing us. Yes, he is. No, we didn't need that shot. Nope. I don't think we needed that nope. shot. See, that's where Nolan's standing in the corner. When DJ gets the ball, Nolan just needs to go right to the basket, yep. and the corner guy here needs to go right to the basket, yep. and they, they'll get a layup. Yep. I think that's but what nobody Coach, moved. That's what Coach Joseph, I think, was just yelling at Nolan to go to the basket. Don't settle for the three-point right. play or the three-pointer. Don't fight. All right. Nope, 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 nope. Hit it in. Oh, Marcus. Uh, See, when, uh, I think when you get oh. that close, stop and pop it. I mean, you know, yeah. we tell our kids in the eighth grade, you know, you, you, that's there's just an opportunity for a turnover. If you make that pass, take the shot. Yep, yep. Come on, Marcus. There we go. Don't foul him. Uh, and we did. All right. That's Fletch's first, team fifth. <laughs> the stage crew was yelling something. I couldn't understand what they were yelling. Somebody boo that man. <laughs> was that what they were saying? <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay. They didn't like oh, that DJ. call. Watch it. Don't foul. Uh, oh, it's Alec. I think his shoulder's probably hurting him. That's two. Well, I guess not. I thought he was wanting to come out. Yeah, I did too. He just needs some water. Boy needs hydrated. Poland shooting two. Forty-eight, forty-six. Wave up. Five fifty-two left to go in the game. Yeah, good box off, Marcus. Yep. Easy back out. Oh, don't pick up your dribble. Uh, Coach Joseph had to call a timeout. 30 second timeout. You know, the kind of the offense though is one that it spreads the court and but it also keeps a couple shooters in the corners. And if they don't if they don't break on this offense, then it it's it doesn't work at all. No. You got to move. You can't be stationary, three-point shooter, and expect to get rebounds, get layups, etc. on this offense. Well, like I said, they've got DJ in the middle like they needed to do in the first half. They finally got a guy in the middle. But when he gets in those middle, those two guys in the corners just got to go right to the basket. Nope, exactly. And he can feed one of them because there's only one guy down there. Yep, couldn't agree feed more. one, they just have a layup. Yep. But they're wanting to stay out there to shoot that three-point shot. Yep, exactly. Which, quite honestly, we're not hitting. No. So if not you're not tonight. hitting them and you no. can get a layup, let's take it. Yeah, exactly. All right, 5.43 to go in the fourth quarter. Wave up, 48-46. Fairborn just has three uh, unanswered points. We had a 48-43 lead, 48-46 right now. Again, I think the Waves playing pretty good ball. I, not bad. Not bad pretty at all. Pretty good, yeah. Oh, roll now back. Now we got to finish it. Roll back. Roll back. Oh. Uh. That's not finishing it. Again, you know, we were talking earlier before the game, too, uh, Randall, about how we've got to learn to finish a game. Yep. And I think even 
Coach Joseph mentioned that in the paper the other night about finishing a game. You know, we're not you. A DJ again, go right to the basket. Uh, it's a foul on Nolan, I think. As I was saying, Coach Joseph mentioned the other night about they got to learn to finish. They got to right. learn to finish when they're ahead. Right. Now, DJ, he saw that guy coming. His best thing would have been to come to a two foot stop because yep. that guy would have gone right by him. He would have. He'd have smacked stop, the backboard, lay her in. Stop, faked him up, and he'd have gone and just, just lay it in. And you know, next year and the following year, DJ will probably do that. He's well, a sophomore. Yep, yep. Didn't play much varsity last year. Played some, but not much. That's a one and one. Yep. Oh, ah. an offensive, long offensive Gosh, rebound. Got it. Long offense. Oh, back pressing. Uh, Marcus just threw it away. We need somebody in the middle. Yep, there's the. All right, we're back. Four minutes to go, even. 51 51. Uh, Again, Brian, I don't. This has been a great game. I've enjoyed every yeah, minute of this. Exciting game, you know, it, very like, exciting. Like I said, both teams have sort of been up, had a lead, giving it away, and back and forth, back and forth. It's been a close game. Yep. It's been an entertaining game. We've got four minutes left. It's tied. Uh, could come down to that last shot. Yeah, it sure could. I mean, and who's going to make free throws? Both teams are in one and one. Yep. Looks like the wave's starting off, coming out in a two-three again. Coming up, trapping a little bit. Yep, I like that. Ooh. Oh, uh -huh. that was a pass. Mike, he thought about he it. He sure Ooh. did. He thought about it. Marcus went to that ball. Good thing he did. Oh. Go, we got a four, five on four, five on four. Oh, Marcus. That was not what we wanted. We got Marcus. fouled. Sure did. Got fouled on a three-pointer. 23, I think. That's Seacrest, a third. Yep. All right, Marcus, let's go, buddy. Hit us some foul shots. There's one. There's one. Wave down one. Three minutes and 18 seconds to go. Short. There we go. Two out of three. Tie ball, Tie game. ball game. Man to man. Waves back to man to man. Yep. Oh. Setting screen number two. He's going right to the basket. Throws one up. No good. Good rebound, Fletch. Uh, they're in man to man. Mm hmm. Now we just need to run our man-to-man -man stuff. Run it through till you get a good one. Run it through till you get a good one. Run it through. Cut. Set the screen. Roll, DJ. No, don't pick up your dribble, Marcus. Yep, too early. Way too early. I think he thought DJ was going to post. Oh, Foster. Go up with it. Get it, DJ. Go up with it, DJ. Bring it out. 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 It's our ball. Our ball. I 
think the fans were wanting a foul. I they, think they were too. I don't think it was a foul. Uh, I, I didn't think so either. I think both teams were going for the ball. Yeah. I think it was just. Yeah, I. Go to it. There you go. There you go. No. Oh, DJ. Okay. Oh. Hit that Tyler. Oh, oh in and it. out. Doggone it. All right, folks, here we go. Two minutes to go. 53 all. Grab it. Grab it. Get on the jump ball. Oh, he called a timeout. I don't know. Call? What'd they call? I don't see an official. Nobody's looking for a towel. <laughs> They're throwing in the towel, Brian. Jump, it's a jump ball. Yeah. It's their ball out. Well, that's okay because a lot they had the ball and then they lost the possession, basically. Yeah. So. Both teams only have one timeout left, too. So it's going to be interesting to see when they use that last timeout. Come on, let's get them going. Don't let them yeah. stand there. Wave will be in a man-to-man -man on this out of bounds. Can't give up a cheapy. Nope, nope, nope. Oh. All right, good, good, good. Oh, no, no, no. Travel. Oh, Call good travel call. In. Good call. Yes. See, you know, and again, we've had that several times tonight where that it's it's just it's that NBA move. Right. That extra Euro, Euro step, step, whatever you want to call it. It's, it's, it's just not good basketball. Okay, man to man. Run your man to man stuff. Come on, Marcus, handle that ball. Oh, I think he's down to the full timeout. We only get four a game, right? Yeah. I, I think that's the last one. I think that's our last one. I do too. Well, I don't think we can hold on for it for a minute 36. I don't either. No, I, I don't. I, I'm not a big fan of that, quite honestly, because it's I, too, I think it's, it's too long. Yeah, yeah, and it deflates you a little bit, too. It's like a prevent defense in football. Right. It prevents you from winning is why I look at it. But I don't know. Yeah. Now, if we had five tremendous ball handlers out there, I could see maybe trying to do it. Yeah. Winding it down to get that last shot. Right. But but I, they've got some kids out there that's got, you know, they some, as I was telling you against the other night it was against the eighth grade in an eighth grade game, we had kids that it's I swear that looked like they had ten hands. Yeah, yeah. You know, they were going at you all the time. So um, Yeah, I don't think either team no. can handle the ball no. for a minute and thirty some without turning it over. No, this we, uh, we gotta go and get a basket. Schultz, Schultz from Fairborn, he's he's a scrappy guy. Um, Lewis is very Lewis scrappy. scrappy yeah. Yep. So, yeah. I mean, they, they got good hands, and they're going to go after the ball. Yeah. But, yeah, I mean, to your point, I just I can't see us going for a last shot here. No. You know, we talked. We scored 30 points last year against Fairborn. We're, scored, we're 53 right now. Again, I think an improved effort. Um, I know Fairborn lost a lot of people, but we lost our leading scorer from last year. Looks like now see now they're run running. Offense. It's called it's called a buffer. There, there it is. Yes. There we go. There we go. Big basket there. That was a big basket. Now. And they, they ran what's called a buffalo offense, and it it worked. Went off the pick and went to the basket. Right. Oh, he went right ah. around him. Rebound. Good. Go right to the basket, Marcus. Oh, that hit the shot. TJ. Oh, Marcus. Dark. Gone it. Take a charge. Oh, he missed it. Oh, he got fouled, though. DJ got him. Two for four at the line so far tonight. Yeah. 
Be ready for a press right here. Yep. Be ready for a they'll, press. They'll be, they'll be coming at us. Box out, though, guys. Box out first. Get it, Mikey. Oh, shit. No. Oh, they called it. Oh, they called a timeout. They called a timeout. Okay. That's their last. Full timeout. Full timeout. Yep. 55 54, way 47 seconds left. Team fouls. Pretty even. I mean, Wave have. Wave will be shooting eight. double bonus on the next foul yep. from Fairborn. I. Uh, I sort of look for maybe Fairborn. I think they're probably going to try to get it into that Spencer kid. He's been yeah. their best player tonight. Yeah, he's he's done a good job. Um, Though Lewis is so quick. Oh yeah. Yeah, he. I like this Lewis kid. He's a good. He's a good player. We're gonna see him again next year too. <laughs> I wonder if uh, the wave will come out in a zone here. Yeah. Here we go, folks. 47 you won the seconds left. You won the good ball game. You got one here tonight. Stage crew is on fire. Fairborn stand. People are standing up. We might have to stand we up might and have see to it stand. ourselves. Fairborn's got the ball in. There was. Oh. Mm, 37 seconds to go. Foster, Foster. Oh, wow. That was Out a, of bounds. Whew. Fairborn's got to come up and press. Oh, yeah. They got to come up and press. Oh, Marcus. Number three, Lewis. Nice steal. Yep. And Foster. a foul by Foster Cole. Foster's had a couple fouls tonight that he should not have. I mean, should not have fouled him on that shot. 56-55. He makes it. Wave needs a basket. Yep. We have no timeouts left. And Wave threw it away, and we've got a yep. foul. I think on Tyler. 35. No, it's on Zimmer. Zimmer. That's his fourth. 15 seconds to go, wave down two. And pulling at the line. Shooting uh, a double bonus. Well, we gotta hope he, he misses both. Still has time, got to try to take the ball right to the basket. Go, Marcus, you got to go, you yeah. got to go. Charge. Oh. That's Marcus's first foul. Wave down four with 7.2 left. That's going to be a foul on yeah. Foster. It's fifth. Yeah. 
And number five, Cole Spencer will be shooting two. Well, Randall, it's like we talked about earlier. Just couldn't quite finish that game. Right. Couldn't quite finish it. He missed it. with the tap in, but a little too late. 60-57. Back here courtside, um, Randall Bowman, Brian Stickle. 60-57, wave loss, um, tough loss. I, I, thought, I thought we played really well. I was, I was uh, really happy with the progress this team's making right now. Um, we got beat by Troy the other night by 10. Here tonight we got beat by three. Um, they're competitive. They're in the games. I, I think that's a huge improvement. A huge improvement. And like Coach Joseph said, I think, in the paper the other night, that uh, they've got to try to find a way to finish. They're not used to being in close ball games. Right. And they just haven't gotten over that hump of being able to finish in a close ball game. And I think that showed a little bit tonight. Right. Um, you know, and, and, I, and I've often wondered, I've talked to a couple of people, who would be our go-to guy down the stretch if we need a basket? And, and right now, I don't know who that would be. Yeah. That's, that's the problem. Uh, the most likely, I think, right now would almost be DJ Zimmer. Well, DJ, uh, DJ or, or Marcus. Or I Marcus, mean, yep, yeah. Could drive um, the lane and, yeah, and, and yeah. Dish, dish or score either one. So, right, yep. right, yeah. Well, uh, we'll give you some scoring here. Do you want to do the home standing Yeah, greenway? I'll do for the – for the wave. Uh, leading tonight was Marcus Wood with uh, 16. He had four for seven from the line. Tyler Bikey had 11. Uh, Nolan Curtis, seven. Uh, Foster Cole, four. Alec Fletcher with three. DJ Zimmer, 14. And uh, Jay Spunger come in with uh, two. Wave was 10 of 14 from the free throw line. Total 57 points. For the visiting uh, Fairborn Skyhawks, we had Tyree Schultz with four points. Dwight Lewis, their leading scorer, had uh, 11, and he's averaging 12, so we did a good job on holding him down. Uh, Cole Spencer had averaged two point, two and a half points a game, yeah. came up with 13 against us. Um, Nate Fosnott, he had four. Uh, Garrison Seacrest, he, had, he averages nine. He got 10 tonight. Um, but the kid that uh, then also this Poland, he had 13. And uh, Kalen Bush, he had five for a total of 60 points. Um, again, Brian, I, I, I thought they played a good, I thought we played a good game. Um, on to the next round now. Yep, next week. Uh, I think next Friday night, uh, we've got Stebbins. I, I think uh, we played Tuesday night even, maybe. Is, okay, I'm, I'm not I sure. I think so, because well, I know we started off with three home games and an away game. So I think we got an away game Tuesday and then next, next week at a, a home against Stebbins, I believe. So. Okay. All right. um, kids show a lot of hustle, a lot of desire, uh, some some costly mistakes down the stretch. Uh, but again, they're they're out there hustling, they're they're trying, they're they're battling, uh, doing doing what they can. Yep, they didn't just, quit tonight. No, I, just I will give a, them that. They yeah, didn't quit. we got down there one time, I think seven or eight. Yep. fought back, and took the lead. Again, it was back and forth ball game. Yep, um, just gotta just gotta learn to finish that. That's all we gotta do. That that's exactly right. All right, folks. Well, for um, myself, Randall Bowman, and for Brian Stickle, um, next time I would imagine Ty and, and uh, Alex will both be back. They'll be back from their interview at ESPN. <laughs> so good night, everybody. Have a good weekend.